Now looking at a typical lumbar vertebrae, and the great news is all five lumbar vertebrae are typical, so there's no atypical ones to worry about. Starting with the body, large kidney shaped. This one, is, it could be a bit more kidney shaped, but you can see the, the, conve the concavity there, kind of kidney shaped. We've got uh, a medium sized triangular uh, vertebral foramen. Look at the size of the body though, look at the depth. The, the, that height there is huge. Pedicle, transverse process. Superior articular process with a facet. And then an inferior articular process here, again with a facet. And then a, spi a, a spinous process that's fairly tall, superior to inferior, not that long though, anterior to posterior, kind of blunt, tall uh, spinous process there. And what we've got posteriorly, on the superior articular process, this bump here is a mammillary process. So that's the mammillary process there. And then this bump here, just to the side of it, so just lateral and inferior to the mammillary process, and it's kind of on the base of the transverse process. That bump there is the accessory process. Just, oh, there you go. You can see it standing out a bit more there. So that's the accessory process there on the transverse process. So those are the other features to look for that are um, specific to the lumbar region only.